Hi guys, a little bit of coffee. Got my cup that says faith it till you make it. And yes, it's a straw because we don't want to mess up the pearly whites. But anyway, I'm back again. Tag team back again. No, but anyway, what's up good people, AKA winners. That's what we do. Hey, that's all we do. Hey, 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 hey. I'm coming to you with another video. Coming to you with another video. Pick it, pick it. Hey, what's up y'all? I'm not gonna be before you long. I will do some check-ins though because I am doing a product review. I told you guys about this because I did a live PR unboxing. Then the last video I did, I talked about this. <laughs> the last video I did, I talked about this, and this is the It Cosmetics Your Skin But Better CC Plus Nude Glow. It says it's color correcting medium coverage skin tint, plus brightening glow serum, plus broad spectrum SPF of 40 sunscreen. And they sent me three colors, so we're gonna give it a go. And today is a Saturday. Saturday is a Saturday. So I'm not really concerned about the whole beating my face aspect, right? Right? I can really just do some corrector, concealer, and powder and call it a day. We got to have my base. It's all about that base, about that base. And we have to have my setting spray because this is just what I use to make everything pop. So there's three shades. There is Deep Honey. Okay. It looks a little darker than what you guys are seeing. There's Deep bronze and then there is rich honey according to the boxes rich honey would probably be my jam but i'm thinking when i open it it might actually be deep honey so the reveal because you know it's not always as dark as the um, box says this time i actually remember to swatch prior to putting on primer this is rich honey and that is what rich honey is giving me it has a pump on there too which i'm loving and i also love tubes that stand up upside down for the simple fact that it allows you to get all your product out of there girl i probably could rock this color but here's the thing i think once i get it all over my face it'll look kind of ashy you know what i'm saying like it's okay right there but blending all around might be a problem so let's get out this deep what did i say it was this deep honey and you guys know i'll do a check-in but i'll probably do it on my phone oh cletus it looks like we're gonna have to play that mixing game because that is too dark okay oh father father let me just see how's, how's that gonna give it to me if i blend that out i do have a, a couple of situations on my face maybe that'll work let's just give it a go because i don't want to mix and and i'm gonna i'm gonna show you like this lazy mixing if i have to mix i'm gonna show you this lazy mixing that's how we're gonna do it but first let's do this primer and i don't know what type of product this is y'all it helps prevent sunburn it can be used as sun protection there she is y'all and oh look at here we even have some really deep deep mocha i didn't know how many um colors we have but we have deep mocha let's go there are quite a few there's 22 shades and let's see what they saying about it real quick it is a color correcting medium medium coverage skin tint formulated with brightening glow serum i think i already told y'all that medium coverage it doesn't really say buildable it just says medium coverage it is for normal dry and combination skin what you say now 90 percent of skincare base okay there's more deets too but i'll just put that in the links so let's let's see let's see if we bad about it okay man boy this is the lancome la base primer it is not necessarily a hydrating primer nor is it a mattifying primer i all you guys always see me use it it's just great for all skin types i use it on all my clients and myself so we're gonna go in with some corrector which you guys always know I do and then I put it under my eye too just to kind of conceal those um or correct I'll say those dark circles because I definitely have some so this is the rich honey and I'm just gonna put her all around and if she makes me look too ashy I'm gonna take some of that deep honey and put it on but I really don't know how this is gonna respond <sighs> I have oh my gosh I do not know I just wanted it to be oh <sighs> smells kind of it smells really fresh. It smells like skincare, to be honest. Like skincare products, kind of fresh. A little bit of a fruity. Um, I'm not I'm not gonna talk about it. I'm not gonna talk about it. We're gonna see. It's looking like it's all right. It's looking like my skin tone, kind of, sort of. Especially, I go off of my neck anyway. I don't go off of my face because my face is a little more red. And I'm looking at my monitor over there, like just seeing what I'm about to get into, what I done jumped into this morning. Let's have a moment of prayer, okay? Don't want it to make me look ashy. It is definitely medium coverage, which is okay because 
because it's Saturday and I just have some errands to run, stop by a little party. You know, I don't I don't need my face beat to death. You know what I mean? Oh man, I'm looking glowy. Oh father, I don't know about this glow up in here. Woo! But surprisingly, Rich Honey, it's not bad. So let's just blend it out. I am going to um, use some of my um, Too Faced concealer on some of these spots that are still kind of showing through because whenever you use a beauty sponge too, it kind of shears out your makeup. But I didn't want to just use my fingers with this product because it's so, it's kind of thin. I'll do that with my concealer because my concealer has a little thickness to it and I can still blend it out. I'm going to use my Too Faced concealer. This is the, um, the multi-use sculpting concealer. This is in the shade Chestnut. And I am just, because it's a Saturday, like I said, I don't, I'm not really doing highlighting and contouring. We are just like, it's just more like a coverage, flawless finish, a little bit, put a little bit in the areas I need it. Now I would say to use this in the summer, you know, to give you that little glowy look or possibly if you want a, a little extra glow, you could do summer. But really, really, I think in the winter time when you are like kind of dry and you're, you need that moisture and all that kind of stuff. And it's not really a lot in the air. I feel like this would be good for something like that. I don't know why people always tend to go for glowy mainly in the summertime, but anyway, but I will say this also, okay? As I'm getting older and stuff and as my taste is changing, I do appreciate a little more like glow. I won't lie to you. Before it used to always be, no, give me matte or nothing, but we're, we're, I, I'm kind of growing into this, okay? I'm growing into this, but I'm gonna go into my Graftobian powder. It is like a banana powder. When I'm just doing like regular, I set under the eye. This is in place of like highlighting because it brightens it, but I'm not using a bright concealer, right? I just use my skin tone. So I'm gonna go on top with this um, one size powder, which I've been loving. This is in the shade Dark 2 Neutral. That's what she's looking like now. I'm just gonna go on top. And I feel like, you know, some of that glow kind of did absorb into my skin, so it's not too bad. Uh-oh, guys, look. Ooh, we gonna see. So this should help it too. Set this with a little bit of powder. Laying on bent, laying on bent, laying on bent. And then I'm gonna put on um, highlighter. No blush, no contour. I don't do any of that. And that's why I said this is a good day to try this too. And then I'm gonna have on glasses so it's all to the good. But this is definitely one of those super, super your skin type of foundations, I'll tell you that. It's not really, it's almost like for moisture almost, right? Just to give you that extra glow. Like I've seen JLo, she has some type of skin products where it kind of helps you um, with that glow, puts that glow back into your skin. I feel like this product does just what it says it'll do as far as the glow. And then I'm just gonna use my Ofra Beverly Hills highlighter. Like y'all, it's always in season to do this. Like, now this is where I don't mind glowing. And then I use this one. This is Gingerbread right here by Ofra. If you guys ever wanna purchase anything from Ofra, you can use the code CKEY to save moolah. I gotcha. And then I just go on top of that and then I go up like right in here. So let me do my little setting spray. A little on my edges, if you know, you know. He cut it a little too low in certain areas, and so it looks like I have bald spots, so I actually have to fill it in. But you can go to my Instagram and check it out. I was looking for my pencil to show you, but I fill it in with this little pencil right here. This Makeup Forever pencil, this is the number 40. I kind of filled it in right there, and then right here, that's just a little tip. Maybe if you're dealing with alopecia or something like that, you could try that too. And then I'll come back and I will show you the final look, and then y'all can tell me what y'all feeling about this foundation. Not bad. I'll be back. <gasps> Crikey. All right, good people. So this is the final look. And I'm here to tell you, it does make me glowy. Not just, okay, so I did put highlighter on my nose and I put highlighter on my cheeks. And so honestly, like right here, it has me looking glowy. Um, not too bad on my forehead, but I'm just feeling, I'm feeling really glowy. But because like I said, it is a Saturday and I just have, you know, things to do. It's it's not too bad, but I do feel like there will be some blotting in my future. So I will um, insert some clips like right now of some close up footage like outside. And then I'll, I'll um, show you some clips at the end of the day. However, you got to keep in mind that I am going to put on some shades. So right here will probably, yeah, I should have probably just not put anything right here, but because I wanted you to get the full effect, I did. But anyway, so I will have on some shades. So I'm pretty sure that this area will kind of get rubbed off just a little bit, but I still want you guys to get an idea of what's going on. So like if you have normal skin, dry skin, oily skin combination, you can get an idea of, you know, if this product will work for you or if it's worth trying or if it's a waste of money for you, for you, because it could be good for someone, right? But for me right now, your girl is glowing. So we'll see. I'll check back in with you guys later. All right, y'all. So in all honesty, 
I've only had this on for, I was under some lights for a minute though, but I've only had this on for maybe two hours. Girl, do you see this? Like, um, I already, I already feel like I need to blot in the areas I told y'all, like right here. They did say that it's a glow foundation, okay? So no shade to them because they let us know. Okay, so now you're not all up in my grill. Okay, I got these shades from Preve Revo. That's the one that Jamie Foxx works with. And so I'm telling y'all, like it's not gonna, I'm not really tripping. It's a Saturday, I don't need my makeup to be super flawless. I just need to look, you know, presentable. I don't even need makeup really if I didn't want to. Um, That's what it's looking like. I will show you probably at the end of the day. I don't even know if I should though because just act like that's not there, okay? So anyway, I don't know if I should come back and show you, but I guess it's worth the shot. But here it goes, take one. It's been on for a couple hours and I'll see you later. All right, good people. This is what the foundation is looking like. I totally brought a napkin in my purse so I can blot. Y'all see that? It ain't bad, to be honest. Um, I got some shopping to do, but it's not bad to be honest because I have literally been getting compliments on it all day. So, hey, 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 hey. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Please do not forget to like, share, okay? And comment, because I love chatting with you guys. But please do share because it does get, matter of fact, when you comment, like, share, all that kind of stuff, when you have that engagement, it helps the channel out a whole lot. Stay tuned, make sure you subscribe. I forgot to say that earlier, but make sure you subscribe, turn your notifications on, because I upload anywhere from once a week to once every other week, depending on my schedule. But your girl is here. All right, so stay tuned. You guys have an awesome, blessed day, and I will see you soon. Bye. Confidence is key. You know what I mean. A woman feels good when she's looking pretty. I don't need no Benz, Lexus, or Range Rover. Just give your girl a bomb, see key beauty makeover.